Right, pull on the cracker. Pull on the cracker. Oh, wait. It's a video. You can't. That's a shame. That's alright. Because the weird little fact is, I used to like taking these apart anyway. As you can see, the... Or as you can't see, inside here, you can just peel on the, uh, the little banger strip. And all you've got to do is unpeel it from in there. Go to the other side. It's glued in there. And usually... Get your fingers in there. I've put, I've got the only one that's been glued harder. Someone really didn't want me to get into that, but yes, if you pull them out, you can then pull out the lovely little banger strip, and you can pull that midway into your Christmas dinner to scare the living shit out of everyone. It's rather fun to do, to be honest. Kabang. Also, another little trick: if you sneakily rip some of these. Uh, on the side of the person you don't like. You have to try and disguise it so they can't see. You'll then usually win the game. But this isn't about how to win a cracker. This is a Christmas Advent Calendar Countdown. So anyway, usual Christmas hat, good for the bonfire. This is what, oh, well, I've ripped the joke in half. Nice one. Well done, me. And we get a nice little cookie cutter. Great. Wonderful. But I've got to be honest, I've bought these solely for the Christmas joke. There's a lot more to this one. There's like a, there's a picture song, there's a what am I describing, but I just want the joke. What music do the elves like on the radio in Santa's workshop? Rap music. <laughs> there we are. I hope that's lifted the mood somewhat. Anyway, it's day number 16, so let's get on with the calendar. The thing that everyone is here for. Aha, we've got a small day today. Hopefully, it's not some logs. Do, does anyone else remember the last year's calendars that had, like, weird figurines, a weird elf, and a abominable snowman? I wonder if we're going to get them again this year, because we haven't seen any so far. Aha, we've got the little um, the clip-on snowplow. That's quite cool. Put it on there. Oh, that fit right on. Oh, that's excellent. There we are. So now all of your Hot Wheels cars can be turned into snow plows. Who doesn't want that? Oh, yeah. And if you want to get really creative, we can take one off another car. And now we're really set out for when it snows. Oh, yeah. Won't be stopping this racer in the snow. Oh, yeah. That's pretty cool. Like I said before, these little additions that you can clip onto the cars are pretty awesome indeed. So yeah, because nice, nice addition, that one. Very cool. But yeah, I wonder if we'll actually get any of those little figurines the next couple of days. We've still got three more cars to go, but I'll have to dig them out somewhere. I've got those two figurines and they had a, like, the elf, I just remember having one different coloured ear. It was really, really weird. Like nothing out of anything else I've ever seen before. Only Hot Wheels. <laughs> But anyway, hope you've enjoyed, and I'll see you again tomorrow.